Hey everyone, I'm back again with Thomas and Friends Ward Review, and today I am going to be reviewing Flynn. When I saw Flynn, I did not like how he turned out, but by taking a closer look in the package, I was like, you know what, Flynn doesn't look too bad, so why not? Yeah, I got Flynn, and here he is. When I saw Flynn on the Wikia, I was like, ooh, that looks, ooh. I don't know if it's just me, but, but when I saw Flynn, it looked like he has less paint on him and less red. Like, it's like, I couldn't tell if it's, if it's Flynn anymore. But, but since I have a better look in the package, he's got some, a lot of details and red on him. But does that mean he's good? Absolutely not. He is nowhere perfect. I mean, he's got great design. He's got some great paint design here and here, but that doesn't mean he looks good. And I will get to that. Now, before I start my thoughts on Flynn, let me read the back of a package, as always. Meet the hero. Flynn is enthusiastic, fearless, and he truly wants to help everyone. Sometimes his over ego bravery can lead to mistakes. But he, he always has what it takes to rescue a friend in need. Alright. So anyways. Let me get Flynn out of the package. And here he is. So yeah. Here is Flynn the fire engine. Yeah like I said. When I first saw Flynn how he came out. I was like oof. He just looks bad. And then I would, ne I would never get this Flynn. But guess what? I decided to get Flynn because, you know, I enjoy buying some few wood to share my thoughts. But, but overall, by taking a closer look at Flynn, I'll be honest, he's got some few great details here and there. Like, some of the sides here and here look complete, but not really complete. At the top looks good. The top head is fully painted silver and he has that water hose on top of it. And also his uh, wagon, which looks like a tender by the way, is alright but not really great. Fully detailed and the top is fully detailed but by looking at Flynn's wagon it's just completely weird because it just looks like a box of tender wood. And also, his ladder, really cool that his ladder can move. It would have been a complete disappointment if his ladder doesn't move left and right. That would have been be the biggest bomber of all. And also, one thing to point out, his face is crooked. Honestly, I should have looked, I should have looked closer at his face a little bit just to make sure there's nothing wrong with his face. Kind of my fault for not taking a closer look. I should have got the other one to make sure his the other faces or anything isn't crooked or or has that factory error on it. But yeah, he has a crooked face. Thought I point that out. So Flynn, I overall Flynn is okay. I. To be honest, I, I thought Flynn was the top number one worst of wood. But, he actually doesn't look too bad. But not that great either. Um, um, I wouldn't say he's bad or, well, not good, but still not that great in some ways. But, he's got some great uh fully painted details here and there um his wagon kind of almost doesn't look complete but he's got some um paint designs here and there his tent is just wagon is just blocky and it just looks like a tender it's just kind of a bit weird by looking at it um when you look at flint's face if you look at the front it just doesn't look complete at all think the front is the bomber because when I look in the front he has no windows no not anything in the front that's probably the reason 
Flint. I don't like this Flint a lot because he just looks so incomplete. Except when you look at the his paint designs, he's it's like he, at least he's got few great designs, but but like I said, not really great. A at least his ladder can move up and down, and also you can move it around left and right. At least it's a good thing. Because if it didn't move, that would be probably the biggest problem of this wood merchandise. And uh, also, one thing to point out is, um, if you look at the front, you can see that black square thing. I'm not sure why is that there or what the reasoning is. If you yeah, by looking at it, it just looks pretty odd. I'm not sure what's the reason for that being there. Honestly, it should have been removed. That square, that square black thingy. But yeah, but just to point that out. Oh, and uh, if if some of you are planning to get whatever, whatever the characters of what you're getting, please pay attention and look in further just to make sure if there's some wood merchandise doesn't have a factory error or a crooked face because around that time when I got Flint I was not paying attention I did not even look further until I opened this package and noticed that his face is crooked but I can handle it I'm I'm not gonna fix it because I don't want to have have a feeling that I actually break it and have to get another Flint but anyways, that is my overall thoughts of Flynn. And I can't believe I got Flynn. But hey, why not? But um, to be honest, I actually thought that Flynn was the top number one worst of wood. But I think the top number one worst of wood is probably Harold. And also, I'm probably not going to get Harold at all because when I saw Harold, he just looks pretty bad. Like, I did not like how Harold came out. I didn't think he looks that good. Less details, um, he just looks so blocky. He just, and his face is just too flat. And... That's why I say he's the top number one worst. Honestly, I thought Steven was the worst, but... It proves that Harold is the worst. And I know there's a new upcoming Kevin. He also looks pretty bad, too. I think he may be the new top number one worst. So, anyways... Like I said, I'm probably not gonna get Harold just to point that out. So you would, pr so here to point that out. Here is my short thoughts on Harold the helicopter. I did not like how he came out. He just looks blocky, less paint, and his face is just too flat. It's just, I'm probably not gonna get Harold. But anyways, that is my overall thoughts of Flynn. And like I said. Not great, not bad, but not perfect either. Wooden Railway Flynn will always be better. But anyways, that is my overall thoughts of Flynn. Um, if you're planning to get, if you want to get this wood version of Flynn, better get them before they run out of Flynn at Toys R Us. And also, look, look and pay attention. Just in case if you actually get Flynn with a crooked face. Because I was not paying attention around that time when I got Flynn. So yeah. So yeah, that is my thoughts. What are your thoughts on Flynn? Do you like this Flynn? Do you not like this Flynn? You can share your opinions in the comments below if you wish. And remember, opinions. You don't have to agree with my opinions. If you like this Flynn, you can share your thoughts in the comments below about Flynn and if you and if you don't like this Flynn you can share your opinions and comments below all you want you're always welcome to share your good thoughts and bad thoughts about any any wood and that is all I gotta say 
Thanks for watching, everyone. And as always, have a good one. Kitasa 1, out.